Exotic food, movies, smoking, and art. You're watching the Shorthorn Shortcast. Thursday, in honor of International Week, numerous multicultural student organizations participated in the International Student Organization Fall Food Fair on the University Center Mall. There was vegan food, Indian-style food such as samosas, Middle Eastern food, and much, much more. The ISO is also the longest-running club at UTA, along with the food fair itself. We have uh, about 11 multicultural, multinationality student organizations that are selling food from each of their country regions. Um, so it's a really great uh, opportunity for the UTA campus and community to, to get to learn about more of these countries and cultures that are represented here by by tasting the different food. Um, it started in the 1970s. It's one of the longest standing um, traditions in UTA, actually. Yeah. ISO is actually one of the longest running clubs or organizations in UTA. The event ran from 11 to 2 p.m. Also in the UC, Health Services hosted the 35th Great American Smokeout. The event was geared to inform people about the effects of smoking on smokers' health and those around them through second and third hand smoke. We spoke to two of the event coordinators. It's a, it's a yearly event where uh, we just educate the campus about smoking cessation and the hazards, smoking causes, and everything bad about smoking pretty much. <laughs> What this exhibit is um, showing you guys is the effects of tobacco on your system over time. So if you take a look over at these lungs, you have two sets. You have your red, vibrant, you know, full membrane lungs. And then over here, you have some red parts, but mostly you have tobacco-filled, tar-filled lungs. Because what it does over time, that tobacco gets in your system, and it develops to create a crust over your lungs, and it kills off that membrane, which that tar makes a layer, which makes it hard to breathe. So every time you take in oxygen, you're struggling because your lungs can't expand as much as they normally would if they were healthy and vibrant. Friday and Saturday is $2 movie night. UTA is showing Clash of the Titans in the planetarium. If you have nothing going on, go check out the epic Greek tale on the planetarium screen. The season of giving is here. If you haven't thought about what to get your friends and family this holiday season, give them the gift of art. Come out and support local artists at the UTA Student Art Sale next Monday and Tuesday, November 22nd and 23rd. A uh, student art sale is a semi-annual event that um, helps promote student work uh, to the community and to the school. Um, prices at the student art sale range anywhere from $5 to, uh, in extreme cases with larger works, 500, but you know, that's maybe the one or two pieces. The sale is from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. each day at the UTA Gallery West in the Studio Arts Center, located at 810 South Davis Street. Well, Mavericks, that's all we have for today. I'm Alana Quillen. You can catch the Shorthorn Shortcast every Tuesday and Thursday, and don't forget to comment, subscribe, and rate.